at the Lure Garden. And I know that this was made by a landscape architect who's a self-confessed plantaholic who had a moment of inspiration in the middle of the night. And the result, after years of landscaping and planting, is, I'm told, a really interesting contemporary garden with golden retrievers. Inigo's inspiration for the layout of the garden came to him in the middle of one sleepless night, and it arrived in the shape of an egg. So that night I went to bed with the egg on my head. I slept for three hours, and as I woke up, uh, I drew the plan of what you can visit today. As we stroll around the garden with his lovely dogs, Inigo reveals the huge range and variety of planting that thrives in this lush region. At the beginning, I wanted to work all the time with uh, perennials. Um, but here in Noyarthun, we have a quite humid climate and many, many perennials, they didn't work. So I started introducing some uh, annual yes. plants to give uh, flower interest during all the uh, season. And this one is the mirror garden surrounded by the yellow border. Wow. So does it, does it get cold here? Oh, you've gone. Oh, okay. Sorry, 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 sorry. That's very important. Okay. You know what they want to do, no? Do it. Go on. Do you know what they happy. want to do, Make no? Them <laughs> they, they, Make them happy. I went for... Oh. for eh? Venga, venga. Venga, Artin. Venga, Julia. <laughs> right, they're happy. Yeah. Now the mirror effect has gone. Yes. Yeah. And what are these weeping trees around the edge? Those are Taxodium distichum pendula. It's a um, cypress, uh, swamp cypress, right. but the weeping variety. Around the central egg shaped lawn, are a series of individually themed gardens. Bananas. Yeah. Are going bananas. Yeah. They love this, it. This is the Japanese banana, which right. here it stands very well, the frost. And this is your big leaf area. Yeah. I created this garden for the gunera. I planted yeah. 10 plants of gunera. 10. Been, ten. Yeah. Uh, some tetrapanax, lots of uh, elephant ears. Yes. What I have achieved here is like, contrast of different types of, of greens and different types of size and form of, of leaves. It looks like if you were entering in Costa Rica. We are in the north of Spain, and it, this gives me a, a sensation of being quite in a tropical garden. So the ferns? Yeah, this fern collection uh, close to the stream. Most of the Dixonias I have in the garden are uh, Dixonias that I found them small in the garden I had before. You're always taught that they grow very slowly. Yeah. You know, you, we say an inch, so what's about two, three centimeters a year mm -hmm. at the most? And I found very, very proud of them. Yeah, they're lovely. Because they do really, really well. Lovely. And now here, we enter to what I call the hydrangea maze, the labyrinth of hydrangeas. Uh, in the Basque Country, they grow very, very well because we have lots of humidity and, and good soil, acid soil. I'm almost speechless because it's so impressive. Uh -huh. Lead on. Let's go. The garden extends to two hectares, or over four and a half acres. The moon garden was, I think, my favorite. Huge flat stones are set with silver and white flowers and foliage. Flowing grasses and clipped yew complete the picture to make a sublime composition. You laid this garden like an egg mm -hmm. in the middle of the night after three hours sleep. Yes. <laughs> That's a nice idea. <laughs> Have you unraveled the garden without pause or, or, or without changes? Each of, of the interior of each space, it has developed as I was working. My relationship in that time started to go bad. I divorced and I break down. At the beginning, I tried to control everything. After two years that I have changed, and I, that now I accept everything. I mean, what, what strikes me about that story, other than the process of acceptance and the wisdom that you can't control everything, mm -hmm. is that the garden, as you become happier with yourself, mm -hmm. the garden becomes happier. It's there is a kind of connection, isn't there? Absolutely, yeah. absolutely. 